What up, guys? Uh, February the fifth. I want to show you guys something. Just, 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 just ride with me. You know, just got through coming from the gym. Uh, I got to lose some weight, to be honest. I mean, not yeah, I do got to lose some weight. So I just came from the gym, doing some cardio for about forty-five minutes. You know, I made it one of my uh, one of my goals for this year is to lose thirty pounds. You know, I'm not going to try to. You know be unrealistic with my goals but you know i do want to lose uh 30 at least 30 pounds by the end of this year so i can get my health in order and just live a good life you know but guys i want to show y'all something just just look everyone pointing my camera look at that culver's that place just open look at all those people look at ihop okay look over here lazy boy look at the movie theater over there Look at all this, guys. Just want to show you guys something. Just, just ride with me and just, and just admire what you're seeing. Look at Jim and Nick's over there. Okay. Look, look at all these. Look at all these. This this strip plaza. Look at the gas stations. Look at Subway. Little Caesars. Just just look. Just admire. Look at all these people out here driving with me. Just trying to you know. Bring y'all guys to light and, and let you see what I'm, what I'm, what I'm talking about. Look at, this, look, at, look at all these over there. Look at all those people over there, all these. They ain't over there just sitting in the parking lot. They over there for a reason. Look at the car wash. People over there washing their cars. Look at, look at Waffle House. Look at Starbucks. Look at all these plazas right here. Look at the Mexican restaurant. One o'clock, people already eat Mexican food. Just, just admire what I'm trying to show you guys. All these, these retail stores out here, all these restaurants, all these products being sold, services being offered. I'm tired of hearing guys making excuses Ain't no money out here. Ain't nobody spending no money. Donald Trump is our president. Everybody, not everybody, but some of us want to make an excuse about Donald Trump being the president. Barack Obama was president for eight years. Some of y'all still broke. Still don't know where you're going. Still don't know what you want in life. Because you know why? You're making excuses. Making excuses for yourselves. I'm tired of hearing people making excuses. I used to be the same way, making excuses. Oh, all the big companies got all the work. They making all the money. You get Walmart over there. Chick-fil-A closed on Sundays because of their own reasons. But I guarantee you, if they was open, they'd be making money. You get Walmart. Check out Walmart over there, guys. Look at all the people over there. They get Olive Garden. One o'clock in the afternoon, people eating Italian food. Academy Sports. Just, just, just admire this, guys. They get all this. Look at all these people out here driving. These people ain't out here just driving around just to waste gas. These people out here, you know why? They spending money. They get loads over there. All these strip plazas. They got all of them, guys. Polo, Polo Tropical. They get loads. Look at all these people out here, loads, Best Buys, Home Depot, Steinmark, Kroger's. All these companies, guys. They making money. You know why? Because they're able to be found. You think these companies out here worried about what, what the next company doing next to them? No, guys. Talking to you guys and hearing some of the excuses y'all make. Oh, the, the, the other guys charging low prices. What they got to do with you? Long time ago, I figured out. Stop, stop worrying about what everybody else is doing and worry about myself. Guys hating on me, you know disliking my videos leaving me bad reviews because they mad because i'm doing what they not doing worried about another man go to the barber shop grown men arguing about how much money floyd mayweather and 50 cent got what the hell they got to do with you what they got to do with your banking account i'm talking about getting into arguments over about what another man got and then the same ones sit back make excuses for themselves See here, talk about how much money another man got, what another man doing, but you ain't got it. You ain't got no money. They don't even add up. They don't even make sense. All these people out here, guys, all these retail stores out here, restaurants, 
shopping centers, grocery stores, home improvement, electronics. They all making money. Chipotle, Pier 1, GameStop. Look at all this. Look at all these people. Even the church is making money. They even understand business. Freddy's Ice Cream. Damn, January, no, February, still cold. People buying ice cream, Zaxby's. Let me just look at all this. Look at all these people over here. Let me pull over. Let me pull up in one of these shopping centers. Look at all these people out here. Sunday, 1.13 in the afternoon. People out here spending money. And, I, and I'm hearing guys making excuses. Trying to get a carpet cleaning business off the ground. You know, uh... Stan and Stevens got feet that vans. What they got to do with you? you think, what? So, so if they getting all the work, they doing all the work. Well, well how guys like me and other guys out here, how, how we doing what we doing? Business work. Glasses. Ross. Look at people come out of Ross. All these cars over here. People coming out, people going in. Look at this. People going in, going to spend money, going to hand day cash swipe they cars party city people getting ready for the super bowl but ain't no money out here ain't no money out here but people got money to spend for 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 a football game are you kidding me chinese chinese restaurant open people women getting their nails done big frog i need to go see them by the way they do real good t-shirts excuses 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 that's all I'm hearing is a bunch of excuses. Like I got, y'all, I'm telling you, I got, I got tired of making excuses. Got tired of blaming the industry. I mean, if it ain't no money in carpet cleaning, if it ain't no money in the carpet cleaning industry, why are you doing it? I mean, ask yourself, if if it ain't no money in the business, why are you in the business? That's that's why I'm starting to realize. Because you know why? You're just making excuses. Look at all these people over here. So much money out here in this world. But people just want to keep making excuses. Don't want to spend no money on your business. Don't want to work. Don't want to grind. But guess what? You make excuses. It's easy to make. It's, it's easy to complain. Easy to make excuses. Look at all these people out here. Hmm, ain't no money out here, so I guess all these people just driving up the street just for no reason. Just this is just let me get in my car and just, just drive up the street. You know, uh, we ain't gonna do nothing, we ain't gonna buy nothing, but we just gonna drive up and down the street all day. Panda Express, GameStop. Look, GameStop half a mile from one another, and both of them making money. Oh, yo, but ain't no money out here. Ain't nobody spending no money. Yeah, wanna blame Donald Trump. Okay. He got his. What about you? That's why he president. Because he 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 wasn't making excuses. He living good. He eating good. Sleeping good at night. But you guys wanna come out here and make excuses. You know, I'm not trying to point nobody out or specifically talk about somebody. I'm just wanna let you guys know, all of you guys. You gotta wake up. You gotta realize anything that you want. Look at that Audi right there. Nice car. I like that Audi. My one of my favorite cars is a uh, 650 series. That's a car I'ma get. Just tired of guys making excuses. Look how fast January went by. We already in February. February the shortest month of the year. Next thing you know we'll be in March. And guess what? Guys still making excuses. It's gonna be the guys two, three, four, five years from now still doing the same thing they're doing now because they're afraid don't want to go through the struggle but guess what go out here every day and get these companies these businesses your money but want to invest in yourself come on man i ain't even mad at the churches no more even churches coming up eight nine churches same church name in a 10 mile radius even they get it. Even they understand how to make money. 20, 30 years ago, you didn't see no mega churches. Churches that we went to better say 100 people. Now these churches sitting 50,000 people, 100,000 people making money. Guys, all I'm saying is stop making excuses. 
You got to be willing to go through the sacrifice. You got to be willing to go through the struggle. You know, if you comfortable, it, 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 put it like this, if you comfortable, but you not where you want to be, guys, that, that, that they don't match. It's, it's like grease and water. It don't match. How you comfortable, but you not where you want to be in life? I'm not afraid to talk about my struggle. I'm not afraid to talk about my problems because we all got problems. We all got everyday struggles. I know I need to lose weight. You know, <clears throat> I got to lose weight. I want to be around to see my daughter have kids. You know, when I get to the point where my business is doing, you know, what I wanted to do and I want to sit back and relax 10, 15 years from now, I want to have good health to go with that wealth. I just don't want to have wealth. I want to have good health and wealth. Look at all these businesses out here. All these people driving. That's what I'm trying to get you guys to see. It's out here. Steak and Shake. Zoe's Kitchen. You know, all these people are in that Steak and Shake. Eating all that greasy ass food. Milkshakes. But guess what? They spend their they, they money on it. They get Walmart. Ain't no damn way I go in Walmart. All those damn people in Walmart. People go in Walmart every day. All those, look at all those people at Walmart. And I guarantee you, if you go in there, they only got two cash registers open. People still going in there. Sam's Club. Can't even go in Sam's Club. I'm a member at Costco. Can't even go in Sam's Club, Sam's Club or Costco without a membership. You got to get a membership just to shop with them. And they pack. Guys, understand. It's out here. You know it's out here. You just got to position yourself and go ahead and get it. That's all it is, guys. It's just it's just that simple. Position yourself and go ahead and get it. Stop looking for a handout. Stop looking for, you know, the easy way out. Stop making excuses. Because I'm telling you right now, I'm not here to feel bad for nobody. Because didn't nobody feel bad for me when I was going through my struggle. Didn't nobody give me a handout. Didn't nobody, you know, say, hey, Courtney. He kick on five or ten thousand dollars to go back on that marketing that you spent in six months. He come he come three four thousand dollars to go on that truck mount that you just bought. He come that uh, three thousand dollars to go back on that transmission you had to rebuild. He come seven hundred dollars for them tires you had to go buy. And nobody do that for me. I had to do it all by myself. Got to go through it. Don't go through it. You if you're afraid to go through it, you'll never get there. Can't get to the top of the mountain if you ain't trying to willing to climb. All these people out here, all this money out here, people spending every day. Sunday, it's supposed to be the day we supposed to be resting. People out here spending. The shop at way of gin let's, let's drive over here i'm about to go to Publix and spend a hundred plus dollars about to go put some steaks on the grill today they about to get my hundred plus dollars look at all these businesses out here look at all this little strip mall all these people out back steakhouse men's warehouse men men that are buying suits and clothes chico's look at all these strip look at all this, this, this strip mall just just look at it look at, look at them guys coming out of men's warehouse that nice Audi he got. I like that. That's what I'm talking about. He understand. He went and got his. But you guys want to make excuses. Look at all these shopping. All these shopping uh, plazas. These stores. Barnes and Nobles. People probably not buying books to educate themselves. Or what, or what they trying to accomplish in life. But now. People want to sit out here and make excuses. Young couple probably get ready to educate themselves what they trying to do, what they want to do in life. But now you got grown people out here want to make excuses. Look at this. People coming in, people going out, making money. All right, guys. So they just, I just want to throw that out there. You know, it's up to you. Either you want it or you don't. But always remember, it's going to be, it's going to be out here regardless. You just got to go get it.
see you guys in the next video and uh hopefully this video will be some motivation to some of you guys out there because i'm telling you keep doing what you're doing you keep making those excuses those same excuses it's gonna be 20 it's gonna be 2020 2021 2022 five years from now still making those same excuses and still in the same position you are today february 15 2017 look at all these look at all these these shopping shopping malls stores making money k's jeweler justin's loft come on man y'all guys gotta get with the program that's all i'm saying I understand the world is full of money all right guys see you in the next video I hate to make this video so long but I just feel like I just had to do this uh, go Falcons <laughs>